We are in the second round of her, her chemo treatment. Uh, this one is plant-based. Uh, the first one was called the Red Devil, um, uh, which is just awful. But this one's plant-based, and um, it's hard on her. However, she just met with a doctor, and he said that everything looked good. Everything looked good. And he'll see her again in six weeks. And then he'll refer her to the surgeon. Um, so, yeah. So that's where we are. She just started her chemo. I think, let me double check. They're getting ready to start. start the infusions she doesn't get a private room today um, they've actually they've been giving her a private room the past few days a few um, few times she's been there and that's been pretty cool um, actually about the past four times but not today they've got her out in a in a pod today um, with some of the other people um, She says there's only one other person there with her today, a little old lady. Said she's watching TV. The old lady. <laughs> um, you know, cancer is no respecter of person. Um... It doesn't care, man or woman, black or white. It doesn't care if you're skinny or fat or rich or poor. I guess it's like the great equalizer, huh? <laughs> yeah, when you're in there, um, you're all the same. You're all fighting for the same thing, for survival. And that's what they're doing. They're just fighting for survival, man. They're just fighting to live. I wish. I wish. I don't wish. I don't wish cancer on anyone. But um, I wish people could see. I wish people could see the real struggle and realize that, you know what, maybe, uh, sorry, this guy almost backed into me, maybe all of our little problems aren't really that, that important, maybe we shouldn't hate people like we hate them for no reason, it makes no sense, because like I said before, and I've said it in just about every, every video you've seen of me, we're all the same, man, that's what I've realized. I hope everybody else can realize that too. And I hope it doesn't take something like this for you to realize it. <laughs>